Hey guys, it's uh, Sebastian Ave here with another mage guide for you. We are doing Ice Burst today. Now you need to complete Desert Treasure for this uh, for this spell. It takes 70 mage also. Um, the runes are 4 Chaos, 2 Deaths, and 4 Waters. Um, and uh, you're going to want to be wearing Stealing Creation hats. Uh, use a mage hat. And uh, gives double experience, by the way, if you didn't know that. Uh, and then you're just your best mage armor. And uh, use an ancient staff for the magic damage bonus. Um, and a ring of life. The, the ring of life is uh, fairly important because uh, you could easily forget about your prayer. And um, and they hit high there. Uh, level 104 or something like that, I think. No, 6 or something. And they hit 20s constantly, so uh, you need to bring that ring of life in case you forget about your prayer. Um, this is going to be your inventory. We want to bring sacred clay hats and um, monkfish in case you forget about your prayer, like I said. And, and then you have time to eat real quick and turn your prayer back on. Uh, uh, prayer potions uh, for protecting melee. And then uh, I bring a Holy Wrench. The uh, Holy Wrench adds uh, one or two prayer points to your uh, to your prayer whenever you drink a, a dose prayer potion. And um, then you're going to want to bring your runes and then a very teleport. Uh, so, let's get there. This is, I'm at Edgewood Bank, by the way. I didn't know. I want to just go to the, uh, the Wilderness Ditch. And then just keep going left, and then jump across when you get uh, to the uh, to the house where they sell rune plates from the Dragon Slayer quest, and just keep going north to level four will be to reach a rift, and it'll show a little exclamation point on your map, and then um, <coughs> then pray melee, and then just run through. Go down the little rift and uh, run through, and go to the northwest portal, and go through it. Then here you're at the mummies. Uh, you want to run through them the exact way I run through them. All right. So you can collect them right because you want to collect as many of these zombies from the mage as we. This can be a little tricky at this part because they line up in a straight line and uh, they get caught and stuff, so we are just trying to maneuver around a little and you'll eventually get it. Hopefully not wasting too much prayer. There we go. I think I got it. Got the middle little ball. Alright, now go straight up. Make sure they're following you. And uh <coughs> then stand at this spot right here. Right at the end of, uh, of this little pillar here, the edge of the rock, and then hit the middle one. Uh, and this is about 225k experience if you're concentrating, I believe, so uh, an hour, so that's pretty fast. Um, and uh, the, the four spots here, actually, I, I left that for drops. So, um, because they, they can drop some good stuff every once in a while, some room things like room skimmies and stuff like that. Um, and they have crimson drops every once in a while, and I do pick those up because I'm training, uh, something right now. Uh, remember your prayer. Prayer, prayer, prayer. Don't ever forget it, or you will die. Most likely. Um, <clears throat> and just keep doing this. collect up in a little square here, 3x3 three three, the box and then you hit the middle one there you go insane mate XP 
Um, don't, oh, I suggest only buying around five or so sacred clay hats. Don't buy any more than that because you'll end up just wasting your points uh, since you can recharge your hats and recharging is cheaper so uh, recharge them. Uh, don't just buy a whole bunch and fill up an inventory with them. Just recharge them instead of uh, <coughs> instead of buying a lot of them. Um, and, don't, and don't kill them until there's only one left. Uh, or until there's no, until they're all dead, just kill them until uh, there's only like three left. After that, uh, you should be good to go back and collect them because they should be spawned by then. And uh, check around for you know some uh, blue charms and red charms and those. Uh, see a blue charm right there. Go back and collect them. And, uh, happy maging!